hello everyone today we are going to make a see-through system similar to this one as you can see we can see our character and other objects behind the wall so let's get to it this is my starting setup i'm using my joystick system for movement characters i got from mixamo including animations all the other assets you are seeing like grass trees rocks and a skybox i got them from unity asset store for free all the lancer links will be in the video description so you can easily follow the tutorial for this system to work make sure you are using urp create an empty project after that you go to window packet manager here from packages select unity registry then search for universal and import it after importing you're going to create renderer and urp asset i already create urp assets so i'm not gonna make another one after creating the asset you're going to go to like project settings graphics you're going to select your asset also set the assets to your quality settings okay here now your pc setup is done let's consider these are my walls and this cube is the chest box what we want to do is like we want to show our chest box from here some kind of silhouette okay first we are going to create a layer for our chest so select chest then go to layer add layer now assign the layer select the pipeline asset that you are created just now then go to renderer add render feature render objects experimental then name it like chest hidden event after rendering opacs q opac and change layer mask to our chest now we are going to make a overhead material here so go to chest material and let's duplicate the chest material and rename like just hidden Also, I'm going to make a unlit material, not the lit. So go here. I'm going to make it transparent. I put it into zero, so I can easily modify the alpha from here. Now we're going to go to our assets here. This one. We are going to add our chest hidden material here. Check the depth and depth takes to greater. You can see we can see our object through the wall. Now we are going to do the same thing for our character. If our character goes behind the wall, we should be able to see an outline or some kind of silhouette of the character. Go to your pipeline asset and add another render objects. Before doing that, we need to create a layer for our character. So add layer, let's call it player and add layer for our character. Let's change children. Go to your asset. Change the layer mask from nothing to player. For override material for character, we are just going to duplicate our chest hidden and rename it to like player hidden. And give a different color. Now go to asset. Add the player hidden material. And write a depth make sure it is greater now as you can see our one body part is obstructing our view from one another that's why it's showing us like the hidden material too so we need to fix it 
For fixing this problem, we need to create add render feature and another render objects. Let's call it like layer visible. Then change layer mask to player. For player visible render objects, you are not going to set any override materials. And we forgot to do one more thing. We didn't rename our player hidden. So rename it to player hidden. Also uncheck the right depth for our player hidden. Now if we play. Yep. You can see our player. So our system is working. You can use this system for your game without writing a single line of code or any special shader. It's really cool. I used this system for one of my game. So let me show you. So you can see here, I'm showing the outline. Let's see. Let me show you again. This is for today guys. If you have any question or need further assistance, please feel free to leave a comment below. Thank you for watching.